This is an ultra thin and super lightweight device, making it one of the most portable 10.5 inch ink tablets right now. I can confidently say it's a great device, especially as a companion tool for professionals. The large screen is perfect for reviewing drawings, diagrams, and long documents without having to scroll too much or dealing with the eye strain. The clarity and contrast of the Carta 1300 display stays excellent even under bright light, which is fantastic for field work. For reading, the AI paper handles PDFs, EPUBs, and lots of other formats natively. Plus, you can run apps like Kindle or Kobo if that's what you prefer. The high resolution display makes text look crisp and covers a large area. Just keep in mind there's no front light here, so you will need good ambient light when you're using it. I've also been impressed with the software updates. VBOTS has been improving the performance and adding new features over the past few months now, so everything feels more polished and navigating the device and using all the features is reliable and intuitive. Personally, I use it mostly for handwritten notes, brainstorming sessions and reading, and it handles all of it without any issues. Another thing I appreciate is how AI has been implemented on this device. I know not everyone may find it exciting, but I think you will be surprised how useful the AI can be for your tasks, meetings and projects. Of course, the AI paper does have a few downsides. It doesn't have a front light, so it's probably not the best choice for reading at night. There are also no built-in speakers, although you can connect it to external ones via Bluetooth. There's also no micro SD slot for extra storage, and it doesn't have a gyroscope for automatically rotating the screen into landscape mode. Those are probably the main things to be aware of. Overall, if VVOTS keeps improving the software and so far they're doing a great job at it, I think the AI paper is honestly a dream device for focus professionals, students, writers and readers. The mix of high-end e-ink hardware, the flexibility of Android and helpful AI tools, in my opinion, make it well worth the price. And at $550 in the US or €479 Euros in Europe, this is definitely a premium device, so it's fair to expect great quality, and I think the AI paper really holds its ground. And by the way, if you're interested in getting this device, I've included all the links in the description where you can check most up-to-date prices.